Uh, Jonas, no, no, she was she bad. <laughs> <laughs> she went with golfers. That was too good. <laughs> Another one of your many times. That just went into a little bit of Sean Connery there. <laughs> just at the he end, slept. didn't it? Didn't it? Slept uh, dead, so uh, dead. Apologies for that. Good morning, Siobhan. How are you? Yeah, very well. I was going to try and do that accent there, but nobody cares. Uh, looking at the back pages of the papers for you, still a lot of focus on Eric Ten Hag. I'll just get through these quickly. The Sun saying tense times. Uh, the back page of the Times saying United in no hurry to part with Eric Ten Hag. However, the next two games away against Porto in the Europa Europa League and then away to Villa in the Premier League are vital. Ten Hag safe for now is the Telegraph. The Mirror talking about who might replace Eric Ten Hag. Simone Inzaghi um, ends with a shout is the back page of the Mirror and Inzaghi in the frame is the Express whilst the Daily Mail this morning going for United Stars expect Ten Hag to get the sack. So they've done their part there with not pulling on the big boy socks and playing good football. Correct. Mm. At the but weekend. shouldn't go unmentioned. No, of course not. You're right, Players that get managers are sacked. Correct. We've all been there. We've absolutely. all done it. Yeah, absolutely. Have you done it? Like, have you actually physically down tools when I, you've no, had no. it? Oh no, <clears throat> not no, down, no, not no, down no, tools, no, no. Shaban. But no. but you've 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 got beaten matches and you've gone home and you're saying, oh, he's had it. That's it. You know, and it's your responsibility. It's your yeah. fault as players. You know, but you just know that there comes a point that, that something's going to happen. And the manager can't come back from that, or can he? Can he go back into the dressing room and get something from them? Well, yeah, I wouldn't say it's a lot. Well, generally speaking, I mean, United, sadly to me, I don't know whether Andy agree, they look past that stage, unfortunately. They look a very much a kind of lost cause. If he manages to turn that round, oh. it, it would be one of the greatest turnarounds I, I, I've seen in football potentially ever, but certainly in a long, long time. Yeah. But sometimes managers can go in and they get, well, you get a little bit of a break. Just go back to their greatest manager of all time, Sir Alex Ferguson. Mm. The rumour is that he was ready to get the sack. Well, and he then was four years before he started winning it. Yeah, and Mark Robbins scores the goal. Correct. Goes to replay, they win mm. the cup. Mm. So, yeah, you can get a little bit of a break, but. Different the, times now, of yeah. course, oh, and the pressure yeah. now Money. is so intense. Yeah. And, and, yeah, and of course, the fact that the Ineos guys have, have, have come in didn't make the change in the summer. They're kind of they're almost under pressure to do something. Mm. Well, there's this piece inside the sun today, Dave Kidd saying, lads, it's Man United. Fergie's old words, lads, you know, it's, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. only Tottenham, yeah. has now become, lads, it's Manchester United. It's becoming a team that's actually struggling to play well at Old Trafford. Uh, Dave Kidd goes into actually who would want to take that job realistically. If, if Eric Ten Hag is to go, who would be the person coming into that frame? Gareth Southgate gets a mentioned. Graham Potter, of course. Eddie Howe for Newcastle. So all of these managers linked from the, the England job as well when Gareth Southgate was let go. Can you see any of these guys fitting into the frame? Andy and I were talking, Shabana. Listen, I, 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 I think, and Andy was, was in agreement, they need somebody, of course they need a good coach, of course they need a good manager, but I think they, as much as then they need a personality that can be able to go in there, not be scared and just grab the club with a scruff of the neck grab the supporters take them on a ride get, get them behind them mm. you know get a bit of belief back in the place because it's if it's not rock bottom it's it's, it's damn near it mm. and as much as they need a good coach I think <clears> they need a strong person mm. and no, I'm, not, I'm not saying for a minute Gareth and, and, oh, and Graham Potter aren't but to me they're not that type no. that they need right at this moment in time what about uh, Roy Keane like a Big person. Do you know? I I said to <coughs> Ali, I said, yeah. and and I don't know if Keno would even want to do it, but what he would do if he said, look, yeah, he'd take the job, right? Um, you can imagine what it would be like the first game back at Old Trafford, the the, the expectancy, and the players need shaking up, Shaban. You know, we managers and 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 people in general, we pussyfoot around footballers, yeah. right? Because. Can't upset me, afraid to do this, afraid to do that. You're right, mate. You're right. Pussyfoot You're around right. these boys, get hold of them and get them going. But that's the thing with that instantly not work, and I appreciate what you're saying, but we know the fragility of these players today. Well, well it's not working at the moment. You've got to try something. Mm. So, Ben, if you can't handle it, if you can't handle that, yeah. then you're you're in you're in the wrong club for sure, and you're wow. almost in the wrong business. Yeah. Because it's you've there comes a point. I think I'm sure even for the boys today, where they must get in their cars and drive away, thinking we're not doing it. It's not good enough. We need to do more. Mm -hmm. they, they're, they're human beings. They will be saying that. And you look at Ange. I mean, he came in. He had philosophy. He had an idea. Everybody's got on the same page. 
after two and a half years, it still doesn't feel like people are on the same page with Eric Ten Hag. Just quickly, Stones, yep. uh, John Stones is on the back page of the Sun Alley. Stones keen to step in for Rodri. Stones' his midfield display in 2023. Champions League final against Inter Milan is the stuff of legend at the Etihad. He says he's ready to step into that midfield to replace Rodri, who's out for the rest of the season. Can they cop without him? Um, well, I actually tipped Arsenal to win the league at the start of the season. Liverpool have started very well. I, I think the blow, and it is a blow, City losing Rodri might just be too much for them to retain the title. It's a bit of a statement. Rico Lewis went in there and, and did away fine, Andy. Mm. But not Rodri. I mean, he, 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 he couldn't be Rodri, let's be honest about it. He went in and, and, and did away fine, played his own game. But they definitely looked as though they missed him up at Newcastle, who I thought were deserving of a point at the weekend. Mm. Yeah, definitely. No, was, I totally agree. It was good. Okay, guys, thanks for that. Shaban. Talk Sport Breakfast. Waking you up Monday to Friday morning from 6 a.m. on AM, on DAB, via the Talk Sport app, and on your smart speaker. Talk Sport.